Kitchen. My name is Beverly and on today's episode of Cooking with Love, I'm going to be showing you my recipe for pasta cheech. Pasta cheech actually is a pasta soup-like dish that's made with chickpeas or garbanzo beans. Uh, it is a quick, easy, weeknight recipe to make or meatless recipe to make. So I'm going to be getting started. So let's begin. The ingredients we need to make the pasta cheech are a small pasta. You could use ditalini. Today I'm using baby shells. You can use elbow macaroni, chickpeas, tomato sauce. This is my homemade tomato sauce. I'll put the link below for the recipe if you like. Chicken broth, garlic cloves, oregano, pepper, salt, and extra virgin olive oil. I put a pot of water on to boil. I'm just going to leave that. And I have olive oil heating in a frying pan. I'm going to add my cloves of garlic. I like to leave them in big pieces. I'm going to let that saute for a minute and get a little bit brown, but we don't want them to burn. This is on medium heat. My water is boiling. I'm going to add my pasta, give it a quick stir, and cook it al dente. The garlic is lightly sautéed. It's become fragrant. So now I'm going to add my garbanzo beans and chickpeas. Lower the heat a little bit. And let that cook. My chickpeas have been cooking for a couple minutes. I want to add just a little bit of salt. We can add extra salt later. A little bit of pepper. Oregano. I'm sorry, oregano. Black pepper. And I want to add my tomato sauce at this point. Let that cook for another minute, and then we'll add the chicken broth to that. I'm going to add some of my chicken broth or stock now, and let that cook together for a little bit. Reserve the rest. I'm, go I'm going to be adding the soup mix to my pasta cheech and then let it cook for a little while longer, absorbing. The pasta will absorb the sauce. My pasta cheech has been simmering for about eight to 10 minutes. This is a consistency that you want, and we're gonna serve it up. And now time for the taste test. I like to serve it with a, just a little tiny drizzle of olive oil. And I like to serve it with some Parmesan cheese on the top and serve it with some nice Italian bread. So here we go. Mmm. It really is delicious. You should give it a try. Until we see you next time, cooked with love. Bye bye.